Hi, I'm Sam with DP Review, and we're here today with the Nikon D5 to take a look at the new automatic AF fine tune feature. This new feature, which can also be found on the D500, allows for quick and easy calibration of your camera lenses to your camera body. This process used to be fairly cumbersome, but Auto AF Fine Tune should enable you to do it anywhere on the fly. This is important because unlike mirrorless cameras, which acquire AF directly off the image sensor, DSLR cameras use a separate phase detection autofocus module under the mirror. The nature of this setup means that DSLRs are sensitive to misalignments within this AF module and between it and the image sensor. This shows up to varying degrees depending on which lens you use, which is where automatic AF fine tune comes in. Basically, the automatic AF fine tune feature uses the contrast detection autofocus of the D5 in live view, which is taken directly off the image sensor, to calibrate its phase detection autofocus for when you're shooting through the viewfinder. Let's take a look at how this is done. First, you're going to want the camera on a steady surface like a tripod or a table. You'll also want a static subject for best results. Next, enter live view. Make sure your AF point is centered as that's the only point where the calibration will work. Next, focus on your subject in live view. You can magnify live view and fine tune manually if needed. Finally, hold the AF selection button while holding the movie record button for a few seconds. When this dialog box pops up, hit yes and the camera is automatically calibrated. Be sure to hit OK to save this value. You can now go into the setup menu and navigate to AF Fine Tune to see what value the camera has come up with for your lens. This is also a good point to double check and make sure that AF Fine Tune is switched on. It's best to run through the process several times to make sure that your result isn't an outlier. Compare adjustment values from several tries to make sure that your result is accurate. Now with certain lenses and bodies in the past, we've seen different values when calibrating lenses depending on the subject distance. So it's best to calibrate at the focal length at which you most often shoot. So if you're a landscape shooter, for example, it's going to be best to shoot at infinity. For a good all-around calibration, we recommend using a distance that's around 40 times the focal length. For example, our 24mm lens would end up at 960mm, or roughly 1 meter. Thanks for joining us. For more details on the D5's automatic AF fine-tune feature and all things digital photography, head to dpreview.com.